And now I want to introduce you all to my friend Lola. She's going to help me explain all about our mission for the week. Are you ready to meet her? Okay. Lola, Lola, what are you doing? <laughs> Gonna scare the kids. No, I'm a secret agent and I have a dangerous mission for you if you choose to accept it. Uh, Lola, uh, I didn't get the memo we were doing a secret agent dangerous mission thing. <gasps> but of course it's called Meet the Kids on a Mission. Well, yeah, and this mission isn't that dangerous. It's actually maybe a little messy and maybe a bit challenging, but it's actually going to be really fun. Fun? Mm hmm And this mission's going to change the world. Wow. Are you sure we won't be secret agents? <laughs> yeah, because we don't want it to be a secret that we are making the world a better place. Oh, I see what you did there. <laughs> Wait a minute. How are we going to make the world a better place? By living into our mission statement together through taking care of you. Our habit of the what? Our mission statement. Lola, you brought the mission statement, didn't you? Um, oh, is it that big yellow piece of paper? Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's that one. Oh, yeah, but what's the mission statement? Well, it's something our church puts together to describe what it wants its members to do and be in the world. Oh, that. Yeah, I don't, I don't understand most of the words. <laughs> That's okay. I can help walk you through it. That's what this whole week is for. Oh. I'm going to grab that poster you got. Thanks. I'm going to help. <laughs> Thanks, Lola. We invite everyone to be authentic, active, thinking followers of Christ who go out and build loving and just communities. <sighs> okay, so what confused you? Mm, all of it. <laughs> okay, well, let's start with that first word. Authentic. Hmm. Gesundheit. <laughs> I didn't sneeze. Uh, are you sure? Sure sounds like it to me. <laughs> No, authentic means real, genuine, and not fake. It means we want to live our faith as ours, not as anyone else's. Unique, it means using our unique talents, our interests, our abilities to live out all of our faith through taking care of the earth. Whoa, so my interests like singing and dancing, I can use that to take care of the earth? Mm-hmm, you sure could. Oh, okay. So it means that we are asking kids today to authentically live their faith through taking care of the earth. Even a tiny toddler can learn how to take care of the earth. Wow, but why should we take care of the earth? Isn't that an adult's job to do? <laughs> no, it's everyone's job to take care of the earth. And honestly, adults haven't always been doing a great job. So we actually need kids to help take care of the earth now. Whoa, in Psalm 24, one, it says, the earth is the Lord's and all that is in it, the world and all that lives in it. Oh, not only is it our world, but it's God's? Yeah, God made the world, all of nature, all the creatures, and all the people. So God wants us to take care of it too. Whoa. Well, we better get to ready to take care of it then. That sounds like a really big job. Whoa, but you're right. Wait, but where, where are you going? Oh, well, I gotta go put on my superhero cape. This sounds like a job for a super Lola instead of a secret agent. 